Korea is perhaps the Western world's biggest outside influence at the moment. But there is at least one thing that the West gave South Korea, and that is of course baseball. Also kinda helped keep their whack job neighbours to the north at bay. Anyway, they do love their baseball, and they have some excellent ballparks. So here are the KBO League stadiums. Jamsil Stadium, Doosan Bears and Aljid Swins. The stadium opened the same year that the league was founded, oddly enough. But it probably would have been built regardless, because it was the baseball venue for the 88 Olympics. That's why it's built right near the main Olympic stadium, and pretty much in the same architectural style. It's a symmetrical bowl of a stadium, not exactly pretty, but from what I hear, the atmosphere is quite intense. Hanwha Life Eagles Park, Hanwha Eagles. This is yet another older ballpark, dating back to the 60s this time. But that's not immediately obvious. You can kind of see how at one point it would have had an even distribution of seating, which tended to be the way ballparks were built in Asia back then. But extensions have been added around the diamond over the years, giving it a slightly more conventional layout. But it still has a distinctive look. It remains the smallest ballpark in the league in terms of capacity. Guangzhou Kia Champions Field, Kia Tigers, who finished second last in 2021, so the name Champions Field is stretching the truth a little, or just outdated because they were the champions in 2017, and they're actually the most successful team in the league's history, so I, I take that back. Overall, it's a great ballpark, unless you're one of the few people that prefer to sit in the outfield, because there's basically no outfield seating. The 25,000 seats are all within the double-decker grandstand. Gotchok Sky Dome, Kiwum Heroes. This sleek metallic dome is one of a kind. Yes, Japan and the US do both have baseball stadiums with a fixed roof, but A, they're both a lot bigger, and B, they don't have a huge skylight in the roof. Well, it, it pretty much is the roof. I suppose that's why they call it the Sky Dome. Despite this feature letting in a ton of light, it's obviously not going to be quite enough to maintain a natural grass field, and so it goes without saying that the grass is synthetic. Surprisingly, it's one of the smallest stadiums in the league. It looks much larger than its 16,000 capacity would suggest. Perhaps it's just the fact that it's indoor playing tricks on my eyes. Suwon KT Wiz Park. KT Wiz. We're back to the boring, concrete exteriors, but the interior is looking pretty sharp after an expansion and renovation five or so years ago. It even has a spiral slide, a feature often overlooked by architects and adults in general. I also like how the upper deck and roof come to a point like a sword, but perhaps the most interesting aspect can't be seen in any of these pictures. When the air in the city is especially polluted, KT Wiz used drones and sprinklers to create artificial rain that removes the pollutant particles from the air. That's really cool, although kinda sad that it's needed in the first place. Busan Sajik Baseball Stadium, Lotte Giants. This one's a little different in that it's completely open to the elements, which might not be ideal, but it allows for some panoramic views of the surrounding high-rises and the hills. It's also pretty much a continuous bowl, which reminds me of Yokohama Stadium. And in fact, I believe it was actually modelled after it. The seating here does seem to be at a steeper angle though, which I prefer. Changwon NC Park, NC Dinos. It's a brand new stadium basically, and potentially the best in the country. It even has rooftop gardens. Hopefully they grow cabbage up there. I love a bit of kimchi. With its grass berms and terraces, the 360 degree concourse, as well as the vast amount of premium seating, it might be the most American ballpark we've seen so far. Like a beefed up minor league park, or maybe a stripped down major league park. Whatever sounds better. Daegu Samsung Lions Park. Samsung Lions. Yet another fairly new stadium, just slightly older. But it looks perhaps even more modern. The metallic facade is quite fitting for a stadium named after Samsung. Instead of a city backdrop like pretty much all the ballparks in this league, 
There is one of nature. There's also a really impressive video board. I wonder if it was manufactured by Samsung. Oh, my phone's a Samsung. I shall ask it. Did Samsung make that video board? How the f should I know? Might need a software update. Yeah, I'd say this one is like a stripped down major league ballpark and the last one was a beefed up minor league ballpark. Incheon SSG Landers Field. SSG Landers. Apparently, the design was modelled off of Dodger Stadium, which is a testament to the longevity of Dodger Stadium, because it was built nearly 40 years prior. Having said that, there are only some subtle similarities. It actually looks very different. The roof canopy is much larger, there's a fairly different seating layout, and the backdrop's completely different, they didn't even come close with that one. The stadium includes a huge video board that gets the nickname Big Board. Well, in Korean it probably sounds better. I believe only Cleveland has a larger screen. At least as far as baseball stadiums go. And those were the KBO League stadiums. If you enjoyed the video and you haven't done so already, please consider subscribing. Thanks for watching, have a good one.